Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. This video is about uh, dermoid cyst and these are the references for this video. The dermoid cysts are subcutaneous cysts that are present, often present since birth and they are present on the face along the line of embryonic closure. Uh, they are about 84% of these dermoid cysts are located in head and neck region. They arise from entrapment of ectodermal elements along the lines of embryonic closure and they are true hematomas. They are the cystic teratoma that contain developmentally mature skin complete with uh, hair follicle and shred glands. Sometimes there is clump of uh, long hair and uh, pockets of sebum, blood, fat, bone, nail, teeth, eye, cartilage and thyroid tissue is present in the cyst wall. The dermoid cyst result from an abnormal alteration in fetal development and it uh, occurs due to abnormal sequestration and inclusion of the surface ectoderm along the line of skin fusion during embryonic uh, development. They can be usually found along the cranial sutures or the anterior fontanelle and uh, so, if they are present in the uh, along the cranial suture or in the head knee region especially, uh, consultation with the neurosurgeon is essential. About 40% of the dermoid cysts are diagnosed at birth while 60% are diagnosed by the fifth year of age. They are uh, usually solitary. However, occasionally they can be multiple. The lesion is a pale flesh colored pearly dome shaped firm deep seated subcutaneous nodule that is asymptomatic, non pulsatile and non compressible. The pathognomic feature of dermoid cyst is the presence of hair that are protruding from a punctum. On histology, the dermoid cyst shows a well-defined ball that is lined by stratified squamous epithelium and a lumen that may be filled with mature adnexal structure of mesodermal origin such as hair follicles, shafts, sebaceous and eccrine gland. This picture is showing a dermoid cyst. This is a unilocular cyst within the dermis which have got multiple pilosebaceous unit that are connected to the cyst and uh, the dermis is mildly fibrotic and the lining of the cyst is a stratified squamous epithelium.